Good morning and welcome to day 20 of Vlogmas. Hopefully the shower in the background isn't too loud and there's also a heater in front of me. So maybe I should actually just film this later. Okay, like I was saying earlier, I have made it my mission to clean the entire upstairs during this break. because so I'm gonna be home for quite a while. So I finally finished in my room, so I'm just gonna make my way around. Cause Lauren also mentioned wanting me to help her clean her room. So first in the upstairs, it's my room. And then next is the bonus room. And that's what I'm doing next. So then I'll do my bathroom, <laughs> then Nathan's room, then Lauren's room. Uh, and then end with the hallway. All right, time. two butter toast and an egg. Okay guys, here's our official before. It looks so bad, but we're gonna make it look lovely in just a few moments. Isn't that right, Mokomo? Yeah. Isn't that right? Yeah. Hi, pretty girl. Oakley are downstairs now. He's cuddling with his mommy. And I just ate lunch, but I completely forgot to show y'all because I was on the phone with Lauren while I was making and eating. But I did get some more Kool-Aid. We're almost out. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? And I could really go for a piece of brownie right now. Isn't that strange? Isn't that strange? I wonder why I can't have a brownie. Yeah, yeah. I wonder why. I just woke up from a minor nap. I slept for like an hour and my body was not wanting to wake up. So I made myself a little cup of coffee. I'm eating cosmic brownie with it. I want to make caramel candy today. But I don't know if we have the ingredients. So I might make a little run to Dollar General. Okay guys, I checked and we have all the ingredients for caramel candy. And Lauren's going to be so excited. We're surprising her with it because she's coming home tonight. And this is literally like her favorite. So she's gonna be so pumped. Um, I'm not gonna. There's a hair in my mouth. I'm not gonna share the recipe with y'all because it is like a secret family recipe, but I'll do time lapse. Okay, no one's allowed to judge all of the crumbs and stuff that are about to start appearing on the stove because I literally spilled this sugar and brown sugar and all the powders everywhere and so you're gonna see it especially in the next clip but i promise i clean it up as soon as i'm done cooking i just didn't film it okay everything is in here so now i have to mix it and then turn on the heat Okay, I just got it finished and so now it's cooling and it probably won't be ready by the time Lauren gets home. Actually, it probably will be because she's not going to be home for another like four or five hours. So there's a chance that it will be, but there's also a chance we'll have to wait until the morning because I don't know how long it takes to set. By the way, she's going to be so excited. It's being a cutie. Hello, love bug. What are you doing? What are being you doing? Cute. Look at the camera. I'm being cute. Yeah. Boop. Boop. <laughs> Look how cute my little baby is. Shh. Oakley. She don't love you no more. Where's your line? Hannah, you literally don't love that baby boy anymore. Hannah? Hi, baby. Love you. Uh, no, uh, no, you don't. Love you. Uh, no, you don't. 
Okay guys, I put just a little bit of wrapping paper here to cover up my address so I don't have to hold my hand here the whole time. But I got a really fun delivery from Bath & Body Works. We're gonna unbox it. So this is my free birthday gift. If you guys don't know, Bath & Body Works is a free birthday gift, which is one free item with a purchase. So whenever I did this, they had their candles on sale the three week candles on sale for $12 or something like that. And so I did that and then I got a soap as my free gift because the free gift could only be up to like a $10 value or something like that. And the soap was like seven or eight. So I got the bang for my buck, I only paid $12. I got a soap and a three week candle. I'm so excited. Here is the soap that I got. Let me switch that back. I got the Twisted Peppermint one, it's so cold. I got this one just because the packaging is so gorgeous. It's literally hot pink. Is that not the cutest thing ever? And then, this is the candle. So let's open her up. I'm so excited to smell this, guys. It's a sugared snickerdoodle. I just figured that that would be so delicious. Let's do a sniff test. It's incredible. It's incredible. I don't know how to describe it, but it's like right up my alley. It's sweet, sugary. So this was my free birthday gift, except not so free because they make you purchase something first, but you get the idea. About $15 in total for both of these. So that was nice. I also just wanted to show you all the finished product to my bookcase because I think it turned out absolutely adorable. I ended up getting rid of the panel picture with me and Andre. I moved the doggy one over there. I ended up putting that back on my dresser. And then I just rearranged this stuff and added this over here. And I think it turned out absolutely adorable and I'm obsessed. And now I'm just about to finish up wrapping the rest of our extended family Christmas gifts and just watch some made while I'm doing it. I'm probably not going to give an update every single time like I did yesterday, but I'll just let y'all know when everything is done. Okay guys, they're all done. So I put them downstairs underneath the tree and I think they look really good. We almost have even amounts of wrapping paper for everything. We have three of everything except the red stripes and that pink one right there and they both have two so it's very nice not including these ones back here because these are just lines to me now there's a huge mess of all these empty boxes and stuff but honestly i'm just gonna leave it till the morning because i am way too tired i ended up deciding to clean everything so we're all almost back to normal i'm still gonna do something about this bag just because i'm obviously not gonna wrap them since they go in stocking I don't like it sitting there. I might stick in my closet or something. Um, but yeah, and I've got to figure out what to do with these. Because this doesn't fit in my candle drawer. And this I'm taking with me to the DCP. But I haven't started like a box or a bag or a pile or anything for the DCP yet. So I don't know. But I am now about to get in bed.